What's up everybody, Architect here with our first installment of Quick and Dirty DCS. Have you ever wondered, who the heck is shooting at me? Well let's find out. You will usually know by looking at your RWR or radar warning receiver. There's four main symbols to help you identify threats. If the emitter has a diamond, it is the priority threat. A half circle on top means it's the newest threat. A flashing circle means it is launched on you and a chevron above it means it's airborne. Another thing to pay attention to is the inner circle. This is your critical threat band and is dependent on signal strength of the emitter. As you can see, we have a search radar in the critical band with a diamond and half circle on top. So at this point, it is the highest threat and also the newest threat detected. Next, we have a MiG-29 pop-up and you can see that it has a half circle and chevron. Notice how the threat diamond changes since the MiG-29 is a higher priority threat than a search radar. Finally, we have the SA-6 pop-up in the critical band. It is the highest priority threat and the newest threat detected. You can tell it's in an acquisition or tracking mode due to the audio tones provided by the RWR system. Since it's in the critical band and locking us, it will probably launch a missile at us shortly. Once it launches, you will get the flashing circle, which will only be visible on the bottom half since it's the newest threat detected. Let's see what happens. As you can see, it has now launched a missile at us. It's probably a good time to start evading. Up, Thank you for up. watching this episode of Quick and Dirty DCS. If you enjoyed this video, feel free to subscribe or follow me on Twitch in the links below for more content. Catch you guys in the next one, and I'll see you on the flight line.